you know, how, how many of you in Pathfinders? Okay. Do you enjoy, you didn't get to go on the trip the last weekend, right? Pathfinder Fair. Well, Pathfinder Fair was an amazing time. We had a good time. And so, um, but I will, it wore me out. We camped uh, Saturday night and had a good time out there and enjoyed it. In fact, our Pathfinder Club put together um, a human foosball game. Well, that was pretty interesting. I never thought of that before. How many of you like to play games? Okay, all right. What's your favorite game? Kickball, okay. Basketball, you like your favorite game? It could be a table game too. Minecraft, okay, yeah, all right. Soccer, soccer, okay. Football, that's right, that's what the rest of the world calls it, football. Um, games, we all like to play games, right? What if you were, have you ever played a game with someone that had no rules? What do we call that? Huh? Role play? Okay, well, there may be a game without any rules. I mean, something you like. Soccer. What if there was no rules? Would you like playing soccer anymore? Yeah. What? You would like it? No rules? Oh, then you could use your hands. You could use whatever you wanted. Yeah, okay. All right. But it wouldn't really be soccer anymore, would it? Okay. But it might be a fun game, right? Uh, Minecraft. Is there rules with Minecraft? No, no rules. You can just do whatever you want. Oh, okay. And it's still fun, right? Oh, so, so what happened? Okay, so you hack in and you do that. What do we call that? What do we call when someone doesn't play by the rules? Cheating, yes. Well, I won't call my granddaughter a cheater, but we used to, we liked to play Candyland when she was a little bit younger. Anybody play Candyland? Yeah. Is that easy to cheat with? Well, you can mix up the cards and you can put the cards just where you want them when it's just the two of you. I learned that, okay? So my granddaughter would always seem to get the right ones that would zip her all the way up to the front, you know, and, I'm, and I'd always get the ones that set me back, okay? After a while, I got, got to realizing that she may have played by her own rules. So when people just play a game and they decide they're going to play on their own rules but everybody else has to play by a different uh, the regular rules it doesn't make it much fun does it it just doesn't not so I used to I told my granddaughter that Julia that I said you know Julia this isn't as fun you know I enjoy playing with you but you know, if you're cheating all the time or you're doing manipulating everything and playing by your own rules, I, I, you know, I don't know if I'm breaking the rules even. So it doesn't seem to be that much fun. You know, God has some rules, right, in his kingdom. And those rules are there to protect us. At home, you have rules, right? Is it because your parents kind of like to tell you what to do and lord it over to you I figured Eli would say that okay back there I don't know what you guys um, but no they love you right they want to protect you so even though you may not understand all those rules and they seem like they don't really apply to you they are there because and you have to trust them just like when you play a game of soccer or basketball or kickball, you have to, or Minecraft, you have to trust that the people who are playing with you 
are playing by the rules, right? Is that okay? Is that right? Okay. All right. Well, listen. So, remember, God has rules. And what are those rules? Do you know? Do you know what God's rules are? Well, there's ten of them, called the Ten Commandments that he gave. And then Jesus summed up those commandments. And Paul summed up those commandments in one word. Do you know what that word is? What do you think that God wants? What is the basic rule for all the things of life that we are to do? Love God with all our hearts and love each other. Okay? So what is, the, what is the word? Love. To love. Okay, let's pray. Father, thank you so much for your love. Thank you that you have shown us what this whole universe is based on, is, is this power of love. And we pray, Lord, that we will only be happy if we know how to love. So be with these young people. Help us to have a good day. In Jesus' name, amen. Thank you so much, guys.